And the different uh, machine types we're going to be showing you are uh, kind of the staple of different machines you see uh, no matter what brand you have. So uh, the reason we're actually going through the different machine frame types is because different uh, types of frames will allow you to do different types of projects. And uh, that's always, I know, an issue if you have something too heavy or too small. You're always wondering if you have the right needle. But we're going to let you know the uh, pros and cons of the different frames we have here. Oh, uh, I'm Marco. I'm a tech with Be So Creative. And this is Israel, uh, also from Be So Creative. All right. And the first one we're, uh, we're going to be looking at today, thank you, Sharon. And Sharon's behind the camera today. She's doing really good. So the first machine we have here is um, it's actually a Bernina. And the machine frame type is actually a metal inside with the plastic outside. And that's uh, really a standard of Berninas. The older Berninas do have an all metal frame, and we will took, uh, take a look at a, a machine just like that uh, later on here. So this machine has a metal inside, and you actually don't see this uh, whenever you uh, have the machine in front of you. This is uh, with the, the covers taken off, so uh, we did this here at the shop. And um, you can see that there's metal run running all along the side in here and down to the bottom. It's all casted as one piece, and then there are separate pieces screwed onto that, but most pieces are metal here. Okay, so our next machine, uh, Israel, you want to? Yes. So, what is this machine for type? Now, our next machine, as you can see, does not have the the metal frame that from the previous ones, but it is more. It is actually the cover itself that is that is integrated into the machine, making its frame. So it is connected directly into the machine. Now it is of different material, a lot less uh, durable and less lasting so it will have some disadvantages but it has some advantages overall if you pick this type of machine so for this type of machine the different uh, advantages you have oh sorry the different advantages you have with this machine is that it's lightweight compared to the bernina that we just showed you this one is going to be very easy to carry um, and also, these machines usually tend to go uh, for a cheaper price. So if you're a beginner sewer and you're looking for a simple machine that doesn't cost too much, these are always nice. But what we're going to show you uh, one of the disadvantages to having uh, a plastic inside. So you want to hold this one? And you want to do the shot? Okay. <laughs> so if you take a look here, there's a there's a crack right in here as you can oh there right there there's a crack right there and the reason there's a crack there is because uh, someone who was using this machine was either uh, using a really thick fabric or a thick thread and the machine just wasn't uh, taking it so instead of giving way at the fabric it gave way here uh, in the plastic so. so the last machine we're going to show you here is an all metal frame the all this all metal frame machine is a is an older machine and most older machines were all metal like this the <coughs> great advantage to one of these is that they last a really long time mm -hmm. uh, as long as you uh, keep up with it clean it oil it and lube it it usually lasts for it can last you 10 20 years 30 years it's really uh, up to how well you keep up the machine um, yeah yes much like the plastic frame the the metal the frame of this machine is integrated into the entire machine so it serves as an external skeleton as well it is a bit heavier than the plastic machine it does last longer the only thing that we do need to remember is that some of those machines because of the type of because it was done uh, using cast iron does rust over time if not properly maintained so 
<coughs> it is to keep in mind. It is still an option though, if you want to something that's longer lasting as compared to the plastic models, but uh, uh, they are older, so it is to consider. Yeah. The only things with these uh, older machines, the metal ones, sorry, you can zoom out a bit. <laughs> the ones with the older machines is that uh, not a lot are made in that style anymore, so you would have to buy a used one probably and look around and see what you would like. Uh, there's some with a lot of uh, stitch pattern functionality and some with very minimal. So it's just uh, up to what you need to do for your projects. Um, so I think that was all the frames we have to show you. Uh, this was Tuesday Tips at and Tricks at 2. And we really thank you. You want to come in here? I really thank you and want to uh, just hope that if you have any questions, you can always uh, contact us mm -hmm. through the website. You can contact us um, by calling the store. Mm -hmm. And if you uh, need any of that information, that's also on the website. So thank you and have a good day. Enjoy.